All right, so it is race day and we're on our way to the track. Um, I'm taking a set of rain tires uh, to the track. All of our stuff's left over there from yesterday for practice. And uh, yeah, it's wet outside right now. Um, so we're all kind of wondering how this is gonna work for the bandos today because it's the forecast doesn't look like it's gonna get any better. Um, and we're just kind of all sitting around wondering why the bandos even have to show up today. Uh, but hopefully, if the track dries out, uh, we can at least get them on track, maybe get a qualifying session in, and uh, hopefully a future race. But um, with it looking so bad outside, and then it's supposed to rain again around 1 o'clock, looks like it's going to be another Saturday of just legend car racing. So, worst case, we'll run doubles tomorrow, uh, but we'll just have to see how it goes and uh, take it uh, as you will. So, it's going to be a wet one today. Don't know how dry the track's gonna be, but we're fixing to pull in now, so let's get started. When in doubt, throttle it out. Let's go. Josh's first run in the legend car. <laughs> That's the break. <laughs> Holding the brake on. This is gas clutch. Yeah. Yeah, we're just gonna roll it off and let you uh, stop it before it hits the pin. <laughs> <laughs> Captain America. Yeah. <laughs> Might be a while before we're ready to hit the track in one, right? Yeah. <laughs> so I gotta start somewhere. Awesome. All good. How about this beautiful weather? Oh man, this is crazy. I think we're gonna sit here and watch it rain again all day. Uh, evidently our boat didn't count to race boat races tomorrow. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> this isn't a democratic society, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> it's all good. Uh, Bad day for racetrack, a good day at work. So. <laughs> Ain't that right? <laughs> all right, Cole, ready for first round of practice? Yes, sir. All right. First race day as a pro. We'll see what happens. <laughs> In the rain. In the rain. Trim, what you doing down there? All right, how are you? We're getting them right. Getting them right. <laughs> all right. Any secrets we need to know? Good. <laughs> What's going on? Just getting us up ready to race. Is this your second time in the rain? Yep, second time. All right. Hopefully we'll do like we did last week and maybe a spin less, so. <laughs> All right. What did we what did we learn from the driver's meeting, guys? Nothing. Nothing? Nothing. So what is uh what are bandos doing today? Uh just yeah, wait, yeah, wait till the track gets dry. Just waiting, waiting. I didn't see Crocs. I just I just saw your feet on the ground. <laughs> <laughs> Pushing Cole out. Round one of practice, a race day. Garrett's going out. Got to push him out. Hey, why are you always the last one? I don't want to be first out. <laughs> this is practice, not qualifying. Round of 
practice is underway. Cole just pulled off. Uh, spotter vision is back on. I'm actually on deck for uh, Izzy today instead of Lucas. We got Mark, big Mark, on the radio for Lucas today. And uh, my job's already going off to, already got kicked off to a great start as uh, we forgot to cut on Izzy's radio. So I got to run up here and cut it on before she heads onto the track. So round one of practice is over. Everybody looked really solid. Uh, I think we're going to rain tires for the feature. Uh, Cole's up first. Uh, they got to do a makeup feature for pros. So Cole's going to tag the tail in that one since he didn't qualify for it last week. And then we'll see if he can advance his position. And then uh, he got qualifying after that for the legend cars. Uh, Young Lions will be up first. It's a quick turnaround for Izzy and Lucas to get right back out on the racetrack. And uh, well, hopefully we can put her on the front row. Yes, sir. Stay close by because you're getting ready to go back out. Yeah. Let's see what we can do for qualifying. Hopefully just uh, qualifying the top five. Uh, I really love rain racing. It's my thing since it's called go-karting. So yeah, hopefully the conditions stay like this and we'll have a good finish today. For sure. All right, so the pro race is getting ready to start. I'm up here on the grid with my cart full of goodies. And uh, hopefully I don't have to use nothing. So hopefully Cole can uh, use the rain expertise to his advantage and uh, make up a few spots in this in his first ever pro race. All right, so me and Garrett are sitting out here watching the pro race. What was that like? Uh, well, it's starting to rain a little bit more, so I think uh, most people put on rain tires right there. Let's we'll see what they decide uh, to do. Uh, I don't think it's next dry anytime soon. Uh, so we're probably gonna have to stick some rain tires on it and go out there and try to dig. Yeah. Uh, we weren't too fast in first practice, but we got some work to do. Uh, we'll try to get back out there and go put it up front for ball time. How'd your first run go? Awesome. That was fun. <laughs> it stuck a little bit better than I thought in practice. So, uh, freeing it up helped a lot. That was a good race. I had a lot of fun. Excited. You went off track a couple times. I know. I know. I think I, well, yeah, we shifted positions a few times. I, I thought I was going to squeeze into the top five, but then I lost it. But then I gained a couple of that. But all in all, it was a good race. I had a lot of fun. First pro race grade? I'd say uh, at least eight out of ten. That's with the rain. I mean, <laughs> I'm loving it with the rain, but we'll, we'll let you know. Uh, come road course time, I really like it. We're loving it today. They let it keep raining. <laughs> What's going on? Oh, there's a glove. Ah, it's over there against the door. What's going on? All getting ready to go off to qualify. Track is very, very wet and slick, but I'm gonna go out and do my best. All right, I hear you. What do you want? Are bandos running today? No. No? No chance. No chance? Nah. <laughs> Did you waste your time today? Yes, sir. <laughs> Actually, probably a little wetter than it was before, but uh, yeah, uh, Lucas qualified sixth. Izzy's gonna start from the from the tail, but Izzy's still learning, so she's getting a little better every time she goes out. She's getting a little bit more confidence, and uh, she's pushing a little a little more out there on the racetrack, which that's always good to see. So we keep working on coaching her up, getting her a little better, and Lucas uh, a little bit more seat time as well. We should have a pretty good day today, so we're keep on working on that. And Simi Pro is getting ready to qualify, and uh, the bandos are actually canceled today, so no more bando action for them. And uh, I think that's all I got to say right now. We're going to keep it under control and get ready for the rest of the qualifying. Pro qualifying just wrapped up. Uh, Garrett's leading our group of guys with a sixth place qualifying run. Dason qualified in eighth, and Justice rounds out the top ten 
with a top 10 run for his in his own right they did pretty good i think the track progressively got worse throughout that session because it was almost it wasn't raining any when the first couple groups went out or if it was if it was it was like a light rain so the track was kind of dry and the longer it ran the more rain that came down i think it lost the where our speed went in that one but cole's up next on deck for the pro qualifying and we'll see how it goes uh when they hit the track all right so i got me and my pal josh captain america right here we're going up to the grid for the young lion race will be exciting yeah hopefully lucas can win today he's gonna be the number one but let's see if he can win and uh hopefully uh get some passes throughout the way and uh see if he can do it in the rain what about is he she can do it too. <laughs> All right. She can definitely do it in the lane. It's gonna be a little complicated for both of them though, but uh, we'll see how it goes. All right. Well, goal, main goal for both of them is to stay on the racetrack and keep all four wheels on the asphalt. That way, by the end of the race, we got something left to fight with tomorrow. All right, so we'll catch you guys in just a little bit. Up your post. I'm staying down here for a while. <laughs> uh, up, Our day's over. Our day's over. I think it was over before it ever started. I think so too. Yeah, no, it's probably my fault. I wore Josh's shirt today and it yeah, rained, so. That's what it is, man. <laughs> Recording me after I dropped my phone like an idiot? Yeah. Fantastic. Dude, my hair looks like a fluffy carpet. Just cut it off. What's going on? Hey, so you got the same gear as this car as Lucas does? Everybody does. Everybody does the same gear. Get on the gas, yeah, tire I just spin. barely get on the gas, it's spinning. Same. I Probably just to say the state of the track. I mean, like, when we went out, like, I'd be in fourth gear. I had to shift into fifth at some point to be able to get anything. You don't think it could be a crew chief malfunction? Jordan's brain not. Jordan Doggy and see his stops working. <laughs> Error 704. Error 404, I think. Alright, so right now we're looking at the hard work of the CMS track crew trying to dry the track off. But I think this is going to be dry for about the Young Lion race and then it's probably going to start raining again. The rain is kind of hit and miss right now. So the fact that we're either going to give the young lines a dry track may benefit a little bit as long as, as far as making the track a little bit more drivable. Um, but as soon as it starts, as soon as the sky doesn't back up, we're going to be right back in the same boat. So hopefully we get the young lines racing pretty quick and then the masters racing. And then by that time, we're probably going to be on dry tires for the future for some new pros. And the cold pro So uh, let's see how it goes. Got them all lined up out there. Lucas in the duct tape number one, and Izzy back there in the 14. So, we'll see how this goes. All right, so Young Lions just wrapped up, and uh, Lucas ran third. He finished third, did an awesome job. At one point, he's, I think he's the fastest car on the track. At one point, then as the track dried out, uh, the two the two leaders got, were able to get away from him there towards the end. Uh, Izzy run her best lap in the rain today. She was really competitive. And... Uh, didn't get the finish that she deserved out of out of running as hard and as good as she did, but she definitely showed major improvement over the course of the day, and uh, she's growing and she's learning. She did awesome. What's the deal right now? I think it's a toss up. We're gonna see what we got with the rain tires on. Pretty fast. You should have been a top five there for a little while. 
every time you're in a good lap, we were on the track. <laughs> so, uh, learning a little bit as we go, right? Yep, hopefully tomorrow we can finish in maybe the top seven. wrapped up. Uh, Garrick finished in third. Uh, Justice ended up sixth, I think. And then, I don't know where uh, Logan and Dason ended up. Uh, Logan got knocked out uh, towards the end of the race there. Got caught up by one of the leaders, and when he spun around, I think it broke the starter off. So he couldn't get it refired. Um, and they took it off on the jack. It may have broke something else, we don't know. Um, and Dason got spun around early and never really recovered, so exactly where he finished just yet hadn't really looked at the order but uh it was a lot of fun um, up front uh justice caught a lucky break whenever he spun out to avoid logan over here in the sh the last chicane for the roval and uh he got a caution he was able to get his spot back so cole's on deck now the pro feature cole start towards the rear but as the track dries out uh we don't know exactly what we've got just yet so we'll see how uh this race goes and see if cole can make his way to the front feature two How'd your race go, Garrett? Uh, went pretty good. I uh, got ended up third. I started sixth. We were able to kind of roll the top there for a little while. Uh, rain tires ended up being the right call. Um, it dried out a little bit towards the end, but we were still able to hold on to third uh, after we got up there to pass some cars and uh, a little bit of restarts. Uh, so we'll take it and we'll move on tomorrow and uh, see if we can come back better. Go out there, big dog. I got carpet hair. Um, <laughs> I mean, the car, like, for what it was, it handled really well. And we, we got rain tires on it, which I, I guess was a good call, considering. Yeah, we I mean, were worried. We were we were all worried. I was really worried too. I mean, dude, going out there to start the race, I was just I was like, heat, 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 heat. Please warm up. Please warm up. I mean, and it worked out. I mean, me and Garrett pushed through the field pretty hard. I came from tenth to pretty much fourth, and I got spun, and then I lost position on that restart. But yeah, overall, I mean, considering how we started today, it did pretty well. Unfortunately, we've now had three P6s in a row, which is kind of a bad omen. <laughs> kind, of, kind of scary. But uh, hopefully we can move that up to a P1 tomorrow. Hopefully. We got speed. That's to chop my head out of this. Got carpet here. <laughs> what happened out there? Yeah. What happened out there? Uh, I got caught up on the first lap in a little bit of a wreck. And uh, ended up that you did call the caution. So I had to keep going, and I got ended up getting lapped, and uh, just keeps continuing the list. So then they finally called a caution, and uh, we ended up being like lap one lap down and uh, in the back. So it's just one of them nights. You yeah. Just go through that a lot, racing. If uh, you didn't, yeah, uh, be pushing for better regardless. <laughs> and, uh, just overall, I don't know. I'm just gonna come back at them on the road course. And I'm excited for the road course. I'm ready for that. Frustrated. Yeah, frustrated. That's all I gotta say. Frustrated. <laughs> Alright, we'll get you next time, Dave. Yep, sounds good. Uh, well, I was holding the line going down into turn three, and someone, I don't know who it was, but someone came and just jacked me in the left rear. So, shifter linkage broke, or the bolt that holds it broke. So, either way, simple fix, but my day is done. Nothing you can do about it. Alright, and on that note, Cole's race ended on lap one. I don't know exactly what happened. We'll catch up with Cole here in a second, but it, it tore up a lot of stuff in the front end. So we'll try to get Cole pieced back together for tomorrow. All right. So here's the here's what Cole's car looks like at the end of this. So a lot of broken parts and pieces. And uh, on lap one was the unlucky part. Car got spun out in front of Cole and he really had nowhere to go. He's just feeding along the bottom, just coming through and uh, ended up in pretty bad shape. So 
that's three bad races for coal to start 2020 so this will maybe take a little bit to fix all right this is going to conclude day one here at charlotte motor speedway for the cookout winter heat series round three and uh, we'll be back out here tomorrow where hopefully is, the sun will be out it'll be dry and we won't have to run for cover in the rain and uh so make sure if you guys are new to this channel make sure you hit the subscribe button down below if you like this video please click the thumbs up button and after that bang the bell off the chip ring notifications for any new videos and uh, catch our, our our previous videos here before on the channel or we got uh work we got shop vlogs we've got racetrack vlogs uh a lot of different content you guys might want to watch but thank you guys for uh, watching and uh, we're en route to that 100 likes on the video and 1,000 subscribers. So uh, we'll catch you guys next time. When in doubt, throttle it out. We'll catch you there.